Hello, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel where today we are celebrating 500k views on our OG day in the life of an Amazon driver video. Now I thought in light of the fact that this video got 500k, half a million views in 10 months, I'm gonna be doing a special video for you guys today. So what we're gonna be doing is over the next few days trying out different techniques in <clears throat> how would I how would I say this? emptying our bags. I'm gonna assume that you haven't saw the original video. We get about nine to 12 bags like this a day, full, full of boxes and parcels. And what most people do is they empty the book folders and letters into here and put the boxes here. I believe that's the most common technique. So today we're gonna be trying out that, but I have been asking around and I found out that there are like five different ways people are emptying these bags. Right guys, just got to my first stop. Um, I want to explain to you what a pick list is. Now, I've never really explained this before, but at the start of every shift, everybody receives a route number and a staging. So my route number is 191 and my staging is B3. It's not really focusing, but these are my bags in order. Black 3207, orange 8977. So what you'll do when you're loading is you'll put these bags in order. So this was my first one. 3207 as you can see on my pick list as you can see on my pick list that's the first one um you can see there's two overflows with it so when i was over when i was putting my overflow in a van i put the two overflows over here um to get a good start the second one's here third one's here fourth fifth sixth seventh eighth ninth tenth eleventh so we're starting at 11.48, we've got 170 stops, it's quite a late start, um, and our first, our first delivery is an envelope. So you scan the device. Letterboxes are clearly the best. For this one we've got two packages as you can see you just jump through one there one here in a little minute i'll go over the process we used to follow when we had our white vans and in our white vans we didn't have the door but we had two seats Hi, how you doing? <sighs> so what we used to do when we had the white vans, we used to, and we had two seats, we used to empty, and this wasn't legal, but I didn't know at the time. <laughs> After my first Amazon video where I put everything on the seats, I had a little, uh, yeah, I was told I can't do that because it's illegal, but what we used to do is, we used to empty the bags out. But because you had so much space with two seats so we used to empty the bag out to the seat and just work from the door this is an age verified delivery meaning um meaning usually alcohol in this case alcohol scan that so you get the year of birth and if they're 25 or under you need to see their id and that's just the process that we always follow because I'm going to be at the door talking to them, it's probably not the best film. So I'll see you in a minute. Well, that's the back garden. Quite a confusing one there. I think that was a dog. Package, there we go. Hello, you ready for Andrea? Yeah. Thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Have a good one. 
the door. Yes. Thank you. This delivery has a box, and as you can see, not in bag. So I mean, and there's an overflow, but because we put our 1G overflow, as you can see, this bag is 1G. I also put the two overflow, the separate boxes from my cage here, so I could get a head start. And what have we here? As you can see, it was already here waiting for me, so I didn't have to rummage through all the boxes like I did on my original Amazon video. Nope. Right, these are the last few deliveries of this bag. Our next bag is, if you've been paying attention, this one, and then this one, this one, this one. Um, so we'll, I'll show you the process of emptying this next bag, and then I'll get on with the day for a little bit until lunch. Please leave any parcels in the green bin. Let's say in. Yeah, it does. And they've got too many, too many parcels to the green. Whoa, smelly. Like in the last bag, I'm gonna put all the boxes there and the envelopes, forward slash book folders here. should be good right I'm gonna do this stop and then I'm gonna get on with the job for a little bit and I will see you soon. right the time is 2 16 I've got my sparkling water and I've got my lunch for today we are 60 stops into the delivery so into the delivery day so we're about we're about on schedule the day for lunch it might be a bit of a smelly one let me put this camera down like so so today for lunch we have got sprats, which I believe is a type of, well I'm sure it's a type of fish, but I, I believe it's mackerel, I don't know, I got it from, if you watched my previous video, I got it from the Ukrainian store, and um, so yeah, the Baltic store. So, it's gonna be a smelly one, the smell's starting to hit me already, but I do like canned fish, I can't, like tinned fish, I can't lie, I mean let me give it a go and on our previous video we got a comment saying i'm getting chubby need to hit the gym i'm not too good for criticism that's true i've been putting on a little bit of weight luckily it's not loads maybe half a stone but my face is looking a little bit more puffy and um, time to get back to it last night we did a 5k run we got back in the gym and um yeah we're gonna do the same tonight 5k runs until you know let's just stick with it as as long as we can broccoli and rice a lot of you fussy people wouldn't eat this i'm sure i'm gonna get on with um eating this taking a little break and we're gonna get right back to it actually on video i really shouldn't eat with my mouth open but yeah so i've relayed out my um my rest of my roof yeah this is next 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 this is next. so i've relayed my route so i've just emptied the bag out here and this is the next one after after that after that after that after that I've just got more space in a van and when you've got more space in a van it's just more you know mental clarity a good thing about this layout is you just hop right into the back you rope and ready your energy is not slouchy because you don't slouch you don't slouch into the back do you but if you sat there at the front 
you're kind of leaning over mm, 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 mm. and your energy is just all around slower So what you want to do is you want to grab your parcels Scan this code as you can see there's like a barcode scanner here You're checked in so I've checked in and then you follow instructions on screen so it says scan a delivery parcel One. Two. Code is invalid. Sometimes you just have to scan it a couple times. It's too big. That's what she said. <laughs> yeah. So there's something you can do here. It says the parcel doesn't fit. Please close the locker door. Find a larger one. I'm ready to check out. You scan the QR code and then you swipe to finish. I know that it's hard for you to love me. Glad you're liking the information, but I'm gonna get on with the day again. Um, and catch up on my <sighs> break so i'm gonna continue the day again i'll see you guys soon take it easy forgot i was filming there we are almost finished and we are on our last bag and we've got six deliveries left the time is let me check the time the time's half six um and overall decent route Definitely not the worst, definitely not the best, probably somewhere in the middle. But like I said, six more left. We've had a few farms, a few businesses, uh, nurseries, that kind of thing. Towards the end of the day, I've been unable to deliver one thing that was alcohol. Guys, you need your, when you've got alcohol, you need to be age verified if there's no one in you can't just leave it somewhere even if someone's at um, and this one here that was cancelled whilst I was working so where are we now we're outside one of our last six and I'm looking for a box have I got any more insights on this technique it's good, it's good, but is it suitable for every every shift? I'm not sure. Towards the end of each bag, I say I've got three stops left. I just I just put them in the front with me to save time. So does that mean I ought to like I subconsciously know that being having your stuff in the front, which you shouldn't do, is quicker. Hmm. I don't know because. Certainly when you've just opened the bag, having your bag in the front is a bit time consuming. You've got one seat and you've got boxes stacked on top of another, so you kinda like rearranging the pile that you've made. When you got three or four more of a bag left, that's when you start to think it's better off in the front. one yellow sticker again stickers on top of the house number you following me Uh, you alright? Yeah, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> Little packages of happiness. 
Ah, very nice. something that survived for 1600 years, survived the Mongol invasions, all kinds of wars and conflicts in the region, the advent of Islam, still they came and they destroyed this. The community, the Hazari people are native to Bamiyan region. You'll notice that, well, one, they were students, and two, they Right, can I get on the here? It's looking like I can. It's looking like I definitely can. It just the other side's a little bit different. Yeah, I'm all right, I'm all right. Ready here, no noise? Ah, that's a good thing. And uh, you might have thought that was a little bit obvious. I mean, it, that one kind of was, but you do often see vans with a straight dint across the top of the van, which to me is 100% of the time them trying to make it under somewhere they couldn't now a couple of times i have had deliveries past certain arches and i had to cancel them deliveries because for me they weren't accessible but obviously some people have taken the risk before and um it didn't work out very well for them let's just say <laughs> Oh man, come on. Alright bro, come on. <laughs> Don't you just love dogs, eh? Alright. We got one final delivery. Is that the same one? Or is that a different one? I can't even tell. Um, is that open? It's electric. Hello. Hi, Amazon. Oh, crazy. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Take care. And there we have it, guys. That was the shelf technique of delivery driving. Who's this message now? Um, guys, if you're a delivery driver yourself, which I know a lot of you guys are, comment down below which style you use for delivering parcels. Maybe you break the rules and go on the front. Maybe you use the shelf. Maybe, which on the next video I will be trying out, you do this technique. So, you have all your boxes here and you come round to the knee and work out to this side gate here, the side door. For me, I've tried it before, I'm not a biggest fan, but for the next video that's what we're going to be doing. Now guys, hit subscribe and become a member of the channel. Um, we have had our first member um, and in an ideal world, I'd have enough channel members and no one's obliged it's five pound a month too unsuccessful today let's see how we do it in tomorrow's video i don't think i'm going to be putting it out tomorrow but i'm going to be filming it tomorrow guys thank you for watching take care i appreciate you